Hello everyone. This is a follow-up from the short that I did earlier. So let's see what that was all about. Dig a little bit deeper into that Ace of Pentacles. Oops. So it looks like there's been some kind of offer. Okay, some kind of an offer here. So it's the start of something. I feel it comes in very quickly with the Eight of Wands. It may be very sudden where it takes you off guard because it has a sense of impending doom it has this negative feeling but I feel it's just where it comes in out of the blue I feel it could be something you've been waiting for and then when it happens often when you least expect it could be a down payment on a house and a home money coming in because there's a reason to celebrate could be an invitation to a gathering a party because there's a sense of excitement there's some kind of excitement in this but it feels overwhelming so this is I feel some of you uh, maybe, you know, the Queen of Pentacles is someone who often likes home, a <laughs> little bit of a home body. But I feel this is where some of you could be working, you could be very busy and feeling a little overwhelmed where it comes in suddenly. But it's saying to ground yourself to look at this because I feel like it's an opportunity that you may be thinking of missing. Thanks, but no thanks. Being very gracious, not really into it. But I actually feel it's telling you it's something uh, to kind of look at how this may play out here because I feel this is something you know, very positive going to happen here. It may feel negative about it at first, okay? Uh, but I feel it's telling you to look at the details of the situation. It could have to do with work. It could have to do with an invitation, a gathering, a party. There's a lot of excitement and maybe even multiple opportunities where there's, you know, just too much going on. Yeah, there it is. It's about looking at all the possibilities, how this could play out. See, a little fantasizing, romanticizing here. See, it could be very positive. So that's that little aha moment where you ground yourself, look at the situation and see this could be very positive. Lovely. Yeah, it's the start of something. Now, I do see a situation. There could be some kind of sudden spark. Um, Okay, idea, something creative. Okay, this could be the one. It could have to do with work, but I do feel romanticizing and fantasizing. Yeah, it's a cycle. See, something ending, something starting, a situation here. But it's very positive. It's where you probably are overwhelmed and can't believe your good luck. If you've been waiting for money to come in or news about a house, a home, uh, a large purchase possibly too. I uh, see a lot of passion and creativity, but if there's a spark of inspiration here, <laughs> a little aha you see a little sad energy oh, this is energy often of chemistry too you could just happen to be in the right place at the right time but it to me it's saying just to calm down to look at the situation to kind of pull back and look at it different okay now this is a beautiful positive energy oh, it looks like being at a place being at the right place and the right time Okay, it's about partnering up. Could be a job situation where you just run into someone suddenly. You can't believe your good luck. But I feel it's an energy of just calming down and being patient. It has to do with something you've been wanting. A job, a house, a home, a love interest, an invitation. See, it has to do with taking you down a path in some sort of choice. Some of you got multiple choices here. Okay, so calm down, pull back and look at things different. There's something different. It might feel a little off. Okay, but if you ground yourself and look, it's actually very positive. It's just very fast and fiery. So beautiful, yeah. And you can see here the chariots. And aren't you just kind of putting on the brakes and calming down, gathering up those emotions. Don't letting your emotions rule you because it's actually really good. And some of you too, it's where all of a sudden something you've been waiting and wanting comes in and then you feel like you're too tired, too drained, or you just feel like staying home. See, so don't miss this opportunity because I actually feel this could be very, it's an energy of where one thing may lead to another. So it has to do with an offer, an opportunity, an invitation, some kind of positive news. And if you take this, um, I feel it's going to lead to something else. Now, if you've been looking for work and you take this invitation, somebody may introduce you to someone that takes you down another path here to do with work. So very nice. Very nice energy. Let's have a look at the Three of Wands. Why is it here? Yeah, so we have someone here. Now, this could be a person giving advice, but this is someone who's confident. Now, it could be an idea. They're confident. So it has to do with clear communication. Okay, yeah. This is somebody often, too. It's an energy of someone who sometimes comes across as a little cold, and it could be the way they communicate. But I actually feel this is someone here putting on the brakes and taking another look. It could have to do with yourself. Oh, you've got someone in their feelings here. 
Yeah, you've got someone here who, now if you know who this is, it's someone who came across as cold. Uh, this is someone in their feelings. I feel this could lead to work, uh, one thing leading to another. Someone's coming in. They're definitely in their emotions. They're trying to control them, trying not to be ruled by them. They're smart. I feel intelligent, articulate. They're also someone who strategizes. Now, this is sometimes, a pro oh my goodness, this is someone very generous. So there's some sort of generous opportunity. It's also someone who's generous with their feelings and emotions as well. This is why I feel it could be a work situation or an opportunity See, it's where it comes, it's something you're waiting and waiting and all of a sudden it comes and then you feel overwhelmed or like you don't want it. Or, you know, maybe while you've been waiting, you've kind of looking at something you thought you wanted and may, maybe now you don't, but I feel you have all this good luck. Okay, it's a whole new cycle leading you down this path. It has to do with choosing. See, two wands, choosing one of these wands, these options, and it's about choosing the path. See, looking at the path that you've been on and where you could be going. That's why I feel this is something that's going to turn out well. Looking at all the possibilities, how this could all play out, but it's opportunity. Good luck, good fortune here, and it's all at the right time, but you may feel the timing is off because you're busy doing other things or you just feel like staying home, you're drained, maybe from working, but I feel if you take this opportunity, this could lead you down another path, I feel like it's worth it. Just calm down, take a little bit of a pause, I feel, and kind of look at it different. Because I feel if you look at this differently, you're going to be surprised. But I also see two people possibly running into each other. Where you just take this one offer, you may actually be at the right place in the right time. Someone here possibly can't believe their good luck. They're constantly, I see a little procrastinating and looking at all this. Yeah, like I say, it could have to do with work, which could lead you down another path. Yeah, someone's in their feelings. They're emotional. So, you know, there's some kind of news communication. Now, it's often an energy where somebody ends one situation to start something new. But you're going to hear about this. I see generosity, kindness, compassion, uh, king and queen of swords, two people talking, communicating very clearly. This is two people who communicate well, back and forth. See, it has to do with whether or not you want this. Now, if you have a choice between two jobs, two people, love interests, you may decide to um, end a situation yourself here. Okay, but I feel it's an energy of truth and timing. Maybe when something ended, when something started, there's some kind of conversation here. But I feel we have someone who's trying to not show that they're emotionally invested. This is why I feel somebody is planning something. They want this. And it could come from a friend of a friend energy with this energy too. But I think you're going to feel something is a little off. Yeah, you see? But something is just right. So very nice energy. I feel you're going to be at the right place in the right time. If you miss this opportunity, you could miss this. This is going to take you down a path. I do see the King of Queen of Cups, the King of Queen of Swords. So I do see communication, talking, being very straight to the point. I also see a lot of charming energy. Somebody who's very charming, very clever, very witty. little dry sense of humor possibly too. But I feel we have two people who are going to connect here. Yeah, It starts with work and then t somebody here starts to get their emotions uh, invested in this. See, becoming emotionally uh, interested here too. So very wise energy. That's the birth of something new here. So this is the start of something new, a new path. I feel like you're open. It's saying to be open to offers, ideas. Okay, someone here is going to reach out to you. And I do think you may reciprocate. But I see a lot of talk and communication about clarity. I see it could be a... Um, could have to do with relationship energy, could be a contract or a negotiation. I see two people negotiating price, money. See, the Empress is, is this is someone being, having the, I feel like you're open. Someone's showering abundance upon, upon you here too. So some kind of an agreement. I feel lifestyle habits, the way two people conduct themselves, seeing some kind of truth here. Now this is a path. I do see some sort of history. Somebody may be talking back and forth about uh, someone's history. Now this could be putting out job applications, but I really feel, and it, I feel that's why they feel like overwhelming, too much happening too fast, too many things going on. Okay, but I feel like this is the energy of the Empress, someone who's not a pushover. So if you are negotiating a contract or some kind of an agreement, speak your mind. Okay, but in a very kind and gracious way. Some of you are going to say thank you, but no thank you to one situation possibly. 
okay? Um, and then possibly move uh, to another. So there's, and I, some of you actually are open to both of these things, but I feel that energy where it comes in suddenly out of the blue, something you've been wanting, and then when it comes towards you, you're not so sure if you want it. So this is often a person who's focuses a lot on their money, their work, their house, and their home. I'm sensing a bit of a homebody, okay? Or maybe working from home. Um, something that's going to work out in your favor if you calm down and look at it differently. Feeling a little differently after a little period of time where the shock, this sudden overwhelming kind of fades away here. Definitely work, but I feel somebody here wants... Um, it's like an ulterior motive is what to be because this is someone strategic it's an ulterior motive it's going to come in possibly as work something that maybe you're really good at you may negotiate something here uh, create a pursuit the empress is here but it's the start of something okay now this could be the start of a relationship um and I actually feel it's going to start out as work but someone has an ulterior motive now they actually have some feelings here or it could turn into that so interesting enough now some of you i do see where there's someone here you may not be interested they're not your type it's telling you to kind of investigate this and just be a little calm here because i feel like you might be surprised that someone who you think isn't your type could be uh, and it could have to do with a job situation but there's the love see a bond a connection a choice it's about two people being on the same page some of you have someone where you think you're not on the same page your lifestyle's different your habits your social structure but i think you'll be surprised once you receive i feel the information so very interesting energy a lot of love yeah i see someone wanting to court and date asking someone out someone wants love see they have an ulterior motive they're strategizing it's coming to do with work or creative uh, pursuit maybe advice things like that then and it could be just the conversation and then all of a sudden it starts um, this person asks you out I see an invitation I definitely feel some of you take the offer and the invitation I feel like you might be surprised or you go with one person who is a friend okay that's where I feel that could be a friendship too where you take this offer opportunity and it leads you to somebody else somebody who's more your type so just look at the energies around you okay when this communication comes in this could happen at any time in the next while so just kind of watch for the signs and the signals uh, first it's going to feel off okay but i actually feel there's going to be a lot of chemistry i actually feel there's a massive amount of chemistry and a spark between two people you might act the feminine you might act a little aloof like you're not interested and it could be just where someone thinks you're not interested because of this or you're just focused on other things at the time so it's possible something's already happened here yeah but this is how it's all going to play out they're going to ask you out okay it's an invitation going for coffee lunch dinner but i feel this is someone who has ulterior motives i do feel this is someone very kind and compassionate very generous um, i see generous offer uh, for work for some of you too but i really feel one thing is definitely going to lead to another so Pay attention to the signs and the signals. If something happens suddenly, take a little pause and try to look at it different. Okay? Take a little pause. Pull back a little bit. Calm down and look at it. Whatever feels overwhelming isn't so much, isn't so bad, because it's going to lead you down this path. Beautiful choices, life path choices, love life choices for some of you, because I see this uh, partnering up, a partnership, maybe getting a higher paid job. But I also feel two people actually taking a relationship to the next level here, introducing possibly to friends and family. But it, like I say, there's all this romanticizing and fantasizing. We know the Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups are like that. I also feel it's really important for romance right now, too, because I'm seeing the energy where you're wanting more romance while well, somebody's about to give it to you. <laughs> so there is a romantic energy and I do feel someone coming up with something unique something different to romance you possibly try to impress you but they're very generous okay lovely energy so take care and we'll see you soon